And actually, you know, and actually, I'm pretty sure I've got these times wrong in here. It's 24 hour time. So, what I do is I usually add the time, and uh, and then if it's not right, I go back and fix it, which is really easy. So, um, now I've done this. I usually leave the comments and discussion area on where people can ask questions about the event uh, right from the website, and everybody can benefit from the answer to those questions. The next thing I'm going to do is uh, select a category. I've already selected uh, Brick House. Um, I'm going to also select Poetry because it's a poetry event. Now, let's say, for instance, you have an event that's not, uh, that's not in here. You can add a new category pretty easy. Just type it in here. Random. Uh, random. And then click Add New Category and it'll add it. I'm not going to because I don't want a random category in here to confuse people. The next thing we do is click Publish. Now we've created us an event. It should show up on our home page. So if we uh, if we want to go to our home page really quick and easy, just go up here and click this link here. Bam! And look right there on the home page. We've got our nice, pretty uh, post here. Very nice. Very nice for your first event. I think it's going to look great. Um, there's a link here to share on Facebook. You can always click that. And what this is going to do is ask you for your Facebook uh, username and password. And uh, you just enter that in there, and it's basically going to just create a generic little post. And you know, you can type whatever you want to, and you can just share that, and it's going to drop it to your Facebook. Um, see, I'm not sure how we're doing on time here, so I don't want this to get too long. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, I'm going to open up a new tab, and I'm going to go to Facebook.com, and uh, I'm going to give you a real, real, real quick uh, crash course on editing events. So we're going to click on our events tab here to the left. It's just real simple to add, and we're going to click on create an event here. Um, basically, what we do is pretty similar. We're going to choose the date and time, and this is, uh, you know, very, very easy to do. And we're going to pick 1 p.m. And we're going to add an end time of, uh, it doesn't say, I'm just going to put 10. That's usually um, what it is. So I'm going to pull with tree. Poetry reading workshop reading and competition. Where? And B R Y associate brick house. Yay! Um, and we can add a street address here. What is the brick house? should know this, right? <laughs> I'm sure that's what you are all thinking. Uh, but I don't, so I'm just going to grab this little bad boy here. Follow that. Closer. Go back to Facebook. And then we drop it all in here. And what I usually do is I just add this in there. That. So you can just, you know, separate this info. I, you know, Facebook. Facebook tends to like the indie. Um, yeah, see? Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And um, select guest. And uh, this is the this is the most this is the best, this longest part here is uh, you know selecting all the guests you want to go because you can go through here and select a whole lot of people. So, but I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna select a few people that I really want to come. And those people are people I know who are into poetry. You can blast out all your friends. You just have to click on everybody. And I'm going to make sure I send one to Brick. Both Brick houses. I want both of y'all to come. And I'm going to send one to maybe Martin, Larson, and Kathy. She's on here. So if you didn't know that some of these people are on here, you can always find them. I think Christina is actually in here. Christina, uh, Christina Baldwin. She needs to upload a picture. But that's another tutorial. And who else? Um, and Kristen Shield. Beautiful. And you basically just save and close that. Bam. Create event. And event can I have an end time before the start time? Oh, because you know why? No, I don't know. Oh, no, I just can't read it. No, no, no. 10 p.m. Okay. Alright, so then we can add a photo here. And the photo I'm going to add. 
But believe it or not, it's going to be the same photo I added on the website. And we'll click create event. And this more info tab you see here is going to be valuable. First thing I want to do is I'm going to grab this info from our uh, post and drop it in there. Enter, enter, enter. Drop that in there. And then I'm going to grab, uh, I'm also going to grab the link to this. So if you click on it, and you actually click on the uh, post there, it'll say Brickhouse Events Poetry Workshop. So we're going to copy that. Control C is what I'm hitting to do that quick copying and drop it in here. And I'm going to write a little note. Visit our site. Okay, and let's, let's see here. Let's still give me this weird error. You have to have an end time before it starts. If you get these errors, you know, you just have to figure it out. Because, I mean, it's telling me that I can't have an end time before my start time. So then if I click this, don't get frustrated. That's the worst thing you can do. And if I click on this, it should do its thing. And yay, now we have a wonderful little thingy or bob here. Or now, uh, to um, add more people, um, generally what you'll notice is on these events, we're gonna, let's go back to our home page, and it should post it up here somewhere. Sometimes it will, sometimes it won't. Let's just click on events, and we should see it pop right in here somewhere. I'm just gonna, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just gonna go down here. There we go. And click on this, and now we have this here uh, we have over here to the left we'll see how many people we've invited if you click on view it'll show you and you can make some different people admins like you can make her an admin and we can make Paywack an admin the more admins the better we'll make Aaron an admin he's been around the brick house a few times and these admins can't I mean they can make all kinds of changes but the main thing is these people are going to be uh, um, the main thing is people are just going to be helping us promote this thing, right, yeah, right, 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 yeah, and if you don't see somebody on this list, you want to make an admin, just go up here to select and uh, select guests to invite, and make sure you've got them clicked, like I don't see Martin in here, so, you know, I'd want to go back and add Martin, um, but that's going to wrap up this tutorial, so we've got, a, I've showed you basic crash course on how to get the stuff in here, you notice our poetry workshop is now in there, uh, under upcoming events, we should have our we should, should have poetry stuff in there somewhere too. And yeah, take my word for it, it's in there. <laughs> okay. Um, so, what should we do next? Well, I guess this is the end of this tutorial. Wow, that was quick. Uh, if you have any more questions or anything, be sure to send me an email and uh, I'll be sure to get back with you and as quick as I can. So, uh, just let me know. Thank you. That concludes this uh, wonderful uh, venture into the interweb. Good night, folks.